I'm Frank Andorka, Editorial Director of Pest Management Professional Magazine with The Editor's Word. As you can tell, I'm not in the office today. I'm in, uh, at, in my home in South Eagle, Ohio, um, enjoying the holiday season with my family. Um, but I knew that I couldn't leave the year without at least one more uh, Editor's Word for you. And in 2009, it was an interesting year for a lot of us. The, the year was a uh, kind of a long year challenge economically, and I know that it put a, a, offered a lot of challenges to not only uh, us here at PMP Magazine, but also the industry as a whole. And particularly in difficult times like that, it's important to thank the people who helped you get through the year and helped you survive it uh, and be successful. So I wanted to take a moment out of my time uh, to thank you um, and to thank some people uh, for their roles in my success. Uh, the first people I want to thank are uh, my wife Beth, uh, my soulmate, and my children, uh, Ryan and Maggie. Um, without them, I would have nothing, so um, I really appreciate all of their love and support throughout this difficult year. Um, of course, my family at PMP Magazine, uh, George Casey, Pete Grasso, uh, Brian Olasinski, RJ Polk, Joe Winans, uh, Megan Hurtado, Jill Hood, Kathy Cooling, Chris Anderson, uh, and Kelly Velasquez. Without all of their help and support, there is absolutely no way we could put the magazine out on a monthly basis. And I would be remiss if I did not take a moment and tell them uh, how much I appreciate and how much I thank them for all of their hard work uh, this year in making sure that this magazine uh, continues to have the high standards that it has had in the past and continues uh, will continue to have in the long into the future. Uh, I want to thank our editorial advisory board whose friendship and support uh, without which we could not really put this magazine together. They help keep us on the straight and narrow and make sure that we are covering the topics necessary to keep this industry successful. Um, our marketing partners, uh, I can't say enough good things about them this year. Uh, I know that it's been a rough year for a lot of manufacturers uh, and the fact that you were willing to step up and continue to support us and in some cases even increase your business with us as a tribute to your uh, belief in our magazine and belief in what we do here at Pest Management Professional Magazine. Um, and I am so grateful to all of my marketing partners uh, for the support that they've shown us throughout this year. Um, after a rough 2008 and a 2009 that it was at best uneven for many of them, the fact that they were willing to step up and uh, keep us uh, continue to support us so that we could continue to bring you the information that you need to succeed as a tribute to their um, passion for the industry. Uh, I do want to thank two marketing partners in particular because without their help and support, uh, the Hall of Fame, a, a uh, industry institution with which I've become intimately involved and intimately familiar, uh, would have gone by the wayside this year if it weren't for the uh, support of Annie Linares of Bug Off Pest Control Center in New York and uh, Michael Weisberger of Planet PCO Insurance, um, also in New York, or he's based in New York anyway. Um, I know that when our founding sponsor pulled out, there was a lot of uh, stress and strain here in the office, well, not here in the office, but you know what I mean, um, about whether we were even going to be able to put on a Hall of Fame ceremony, and uh, Michael and uh, Andy really stepped up and, and made it happen, so we really, uh, without, with their help, we were able to put on a, a spectacular ceremony in Las Vegas, and uh, I want to thank them for all of their help and support with that. Um, on that note, I also want to thank uh, Kurt and Heidi Trombetti um, of EnviroSafe Pest Control in Las Vegas. Uh, they were helping; they helped us scout out a location um, for the Hall of Fame uh, in Las Vegas. As you, um, all, all of you who are there know, is a fairly expensive city, but they were able to help us find a venue that we were able that our sponsors were able to help us out with, um, and we were able to put on a uh, perhaps the best Hall of Fame ceremony yet. So, uh, Kurt and Heidi, I, we couldn't have done it without you. We really appreciate your help on that as well. Um, and last but not least, I want to thank all of my readers, because without you guys, um, there would be no reason for us uh, to, to put out this magazine and uh, to try and be the industry's leading information source. It's all of your help, support, and feedback uh, that allow us to do that, and, and frankly, your participation in the magazine as well um, helps keep us going. 
So I really do appreciate um, all of your support, and I have a really good feeling about 2010. Um, I know that uh, the signs of that the economy are beginning to improve are um, slowly but surely increasing as we sort of end the year here. And uh, in my gut, which has been pretty successful at anticipating the year, um, how well the year is going to go, uh, I think 2010 is going to be a good year for all of us. So I want to take a moment to wish you all happy holidays, uh, Merry Christmas, have a wonderful new year, and I will see you when I get back into the office on January 4th. I'm Frank Andorka, Editorial Director of Pest Management Professional Magazine. Until next year.